This is a critical reasoning question. In this question, the author states that the United Kingdom should adopt a written constitution because if it does, then it will restrict the behavior of the government and the powers of the state will come under judicial review. The question asks us to identify an option which will support the cause of a written constitution. Option A. It is important to enshrine clarity in legal code in order to engage in economic, social and political relations. This option definitely supports the cause of a written constitution because if there is a written constitution, the citizens will have more clarity on what is acceptable, what is legal and what is not. And this will help the citizens to have cordial economic, social and political relations. Option B. When Hitler came to power by election, he quickly dismantled the constitutional checks on his power. These constitutional checks may be part of a written or unwritten constitution. We cannot comment on that. So option B does neither supports nor weakens the cause of a written constitution. Option C. It is far wiser to rely on the will of the state than to depend on a constitution. Now here in this case also we cannot say whether the constitution that is referred to is a written or unwritten constitution. This option can be true for both the cases so it neither supports that is strengthens nor weakens the cause of a written constitution. Option D. The metric by which laws are evaluated in a democracy ought to be whether the populace accepts them as just. Again in this case we cannot comment on the fact that it affects the cause of a written constitution, it neither, of, neither supports nor weakens the cause and hence the only option that affects or that supports the cause of a written constitution is option A and that is the correct answer to this question.